hello collective welcome back to my channel i hope everybody is doing well all right we're gonna go ahead and get into an energy check-in um this will be a 72 for you i actually have one uploading okay um but we're gonna see what other energy that we get okay that was a kind of a different energy okay um 72 for you yesterday today tomorrow okay um happy birthday to any cancers okay uh personal readings are 40 percent off all right um join us on patreon as well for exclusive ad free content uh if you like it here you will love it there okay as far as the messages it's very in-depth okay they're very in-depth they're good okay um and love readings are on tiktok the link is below all right so let's see holy spirit holy angels ancestor spirit guides what messages do you have for the collective 72 for you can we get something different from that last message please okay check that one out too the last message is more so for people who are hateful okay it's telling them what their 72 is like all right so can we get something else please spirit um for the collective but you choose the message if that's the tone it's just the tone we can't change the energy and what's going on okay all right holy spirit holy angels ancestors and spirit guides what's going on for the collective 72 for you if you're new here 72 for you is yesterday today tomorrow now you time is fluid give it take a couple days out the front or the end okay and when you see it is when you're meant to see it so a year from now if you're watching this hello okay it's 72 hours yesterday today tomorrow it's going to be something significant that resonates okay for you now keep in mind this is general and collective if you need a personal reading the link to book with me is below okay all right what do we have holy spirit holy angels ancestors and spirit guides for the collective what, what's going on 72 for you happy happy i love it 26 okay the number 26 the number 62 or 8 could be significant okay uh community the number eight <laughs> round and round truth be told okay all right so something is making you happy okay something is happy uh, is happy something could deal with family though community round and round truth be told no place like home yeah i feel like also something to do with your family maybe it's the same thing you it's always the same thing it's nothing new going on it's the same old same old okay um that's a good start very good start community round and round truth be told in a place like home okay been away okay so some of you could have been away or something deals with the distance maybe you're, you're at a distance right now or your family you far away from home you far away from your community yeah now this could be how somebody feels about you I feel like somebody could be missing you for some of you maybe you were somebody's happy they were happy in a family with you but you take it how it resonates it says be open to love okay let go and enjoy Ooh, so maybe some of you are going somewhere oh that says laugh at your demons say no but let go and enjoy maybe some of you are going somewhere though <clears throat> you're going to a particular place um, like a, this could be like amusement park or uh, a, a, yeah, a certain attraction or maybe you're just going to a certain store. This is somewhere where you may go regularly with the round and round. You go here regularly. Uh, it's like home. Well, there's no place like home. You go like clockwork. Okay, it makes you happy to be there. So for most of us, it may be Target. For, for some people, it's for other people. I mean, this could be Trader Joe's. Just wherever your spot would be. Okay. Um, let's see. What What's going on here? 72 for you for the collective. What's going on? Archangel Michael, please protect me as I channel the messages. Love Unbound. Okay. 36, the number 63 or 9. Support. Support, change, rest. Okay. So there's some kind of change that's coming in that's going to grant you some kind of rest. Okay. Or I feel like somebody is also being laid to rest with the ascending soul being here or something deals with someone who is. Okay. 25, 52, 7. Uh, the number two, the number 13, the number 31, the number four, and the number three. 
could be significant, okay? Uh, those could be birthdays, ages, anything like that, okay? You take it how it uh, resonates to you. Yeah, so something could have something to do with, you know, community gathering. Yeah, with the round and round in the community. Yeah, so some people could be traveling home or traveling back to where they're from or traveling to a certain community for a funeral is what I'm getting. But you take it how it resonates to you because it does say happy, happy. Okay, um, something could be a family reunion. Okay, Queen of Swords, Six of Wands. Okay, so somebody could be speaking publicly or something deals with a public speaker. You got the tower. So something could be shocking, whatever this is, justice. So something is being announced here. This could be something that you, you could be seeing like being announced. This could be like, so this could be like news. Uh, Page of Pentacles, Ten of Wands. All right. It says let go and enjoy. Happy, happy. I like this. Okay. So maybe you're just letting go of a lot of baggage. You, you, you're dumping off a lot of baggage. Or this would be like a clean slate here. But you got the Ten of Wands. It's back. Eight of Wands. So something could deal with a lot of communication. Or it's just a lot coming in. Okay. Uh, with the uh, Nine of Pentacles and the Four of Cups. I'm telling you. Something is like a level of comfort. Something could deal with a lot of wind. Something could be breezy. Look at this. The Ace of Cups. Now some of you could be like at the beach or something like that. This looks very good. Yes. I feel like some Something is great yes okay what else is going on here looks good so maybe you go to this place often like I said maybe you could like the beach you got the Emperor you got the four of cups nine of Pentacles eight of wands is back the moon with the Empress okay I feel like somebody could have rejected you or or something like that but you take it how it resonates maybe somebody in your family your dad could be telling you something okay maybe it's a lie five of swords of the death card or something deals with who you may share children with the emperor in the page of pentacles is out here you got the devil right here with the justice card so something definitely deals with the government three of one three of cups four of pentacles maybe somebody isn't saying it's something that's being left out you take it how it resonates or what's left out you got the three of pentacles so I feel like something could definitely be a family issue. You're, 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 you're having like some kind of conflict for some of you. Don't let it get the best of you, but you're having some kind of conflict with maybe a family member or something like that. Because you feel like they left you out of the loop or something or they lied to you. Or something could be in the way they treat you. Treat you. Maybe something could be in the way they talk to you. Maybe, you know, maybe they post about you. Maybe this, maybe that. It's something that's very hurtful to you, though. It makes you feel some kind of way five of cups to the empress yeah so whatever this is it hurts all right now something could also have something to do with your mother a baby mother or uh just whoever this is whoever this person is they looks like they could have a womb that's the moon and the empress okay um so there could have definitely been something here something could deal with a child here this child could be a, a capricorn um a scorpio and aries or these could be the place your placements or the family or, or somebody in the family somebody's mother your mother uh the baby mother okay you got temperance here you got the six of wands is back so yeah there's definitely something here that's happening uh some form of success i feel like something is definitely taken off for you for some of you um <laughs> i just heard nothing could stop me i'm on the way up that's what I just heard. So somebody's on the way up. You're on the way up. It looks very good. Something makes you very happy. Uh, Six of Wands and a Knight of Cups. I feel like somebody could be uh, wanting to ask you out. Somebody could want to ask you out. Uh, Queen of Cups, the Two of Swords. I don't, I don't know what's up with the... Something could have something to do with who someone could be dating. So this would be like somebody who... Somebody could be about to pass away because they don't want you to see people. Yeah, Like maybe... Yeah, take that as a sign of something missing. Yeah, they don't want you to see. They want things to fall apart for you. This is somebody who doesn't wish you well. Even if they tell you, I hope you do good, or they congratulate you, they don't really wish you would do good. They don't really wish you well. They don't, want, but it's, this could be somebody for some of you. Well, you have kids with this person or their family member, but they don't want, they want to see you do well, but how much do they lose in the, in the, in the, 
in the scenario do they gain anything in the scenario does it hinder them in any way it's something like that so it's like a it's like a fine line like it's like i'm happy for you but if i'm benefiting from it yeah like i hate to even bring this back up but i'm gonna say it i'm gonna say it and i'm gonna say it and i don't even know if in in in, in and i mean this in the best way Okay, I'm going to say it. There's a chariot right here. Because I thought about making a video about this. Okay. But, like, it, this right here puts me in the mind of, like, Ashanti. Okay. And I ain't trying. I don't even know. What, she a Libra. Okay. I'm sorry. But, anyway. But it puts me in the mind of Ashanti. Okay. And her being happy about her pregnancy. Okay. She's married. They eloped. Da, 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 da. I'm happy for her. And I really do really, really, really genuinely in my heart of hearts feel like her and Nelly. I already said that, like even this little, I don't know if y'all watched that little E exclusive thing that she did. Like she posted a few days ago, but e Entertainment Tonight posted, uh, they did like a little interview or whatever with her. And I love the way she moves. See, that's why I love Ashanti. I love, she's always been a very private person. You gonna see me when i'm outside you're gonna see me getting this check you're gonna see me getting this money but as far as everything every single crack and crevice of my life i'm not gonna tell you the move i'm making before i make it or even exactly at the time i make it you're gonna find out when i want to announce it you see what i'm saying that's how you protect your happiness because there's people out here plotting they can't wait to get their fingers on it. You want to make sure it's already concrete and you know you got what you got going on before you even go there. Okay? But, you know, I rem and I probably wouldn't even known this if it weren't for doggone Tasha K calling the girl out, but her little sister. Somebody asked her little sister while her little sister was on a live like well, with your sister having a baby or get, be, and being engaged, did that put any pressure on you? And the girl, like, rolls up and was like, hell to the f No. That's what I'm trying to prevent or stop. Like, I want us to get out of that. And it's like, get out of what? Like, what's what's what was wrong with just a simple... Uh, does that put any pressure on you? No, not at all. I'm happy for my sister. And move on! You see what I'm saying? It's like, it's that type of, it's something like that going on here. But it's unspoken. I don't know if she was just in the moment and what took over and made, like, even if it was like it didn't come off that way. For somebody who can, who know people and body language. And this and that. Because of course Tasha K played the video. And then she say pause. <laughs> and then she played the video again. Rewind it back. And then say pause. Pause. It's something like that. You know what I'm saying? But it's. it's it, but with the body language. And the, you was just cool and chilling. <clears throat> but that struck a nerve that somebody asked you that. That's my song. But it struck a nerve and it's like, oh, like it almost felt like a rage, like a, I'm holding the rage in. But anyway, I ain't mean to just get all deep into it, but I'm really genuinely happy for Ashanti. Like for real, her and Nelly, because y'all know I already said this. I actually said it on a cancer reading when they reconcile. I use that as an example. I'm not a fan of reconciliation, but I'm not completely against it. Gather the gather the the facts of your life and the person's life. Where the, how did y'all end? How bad did it get? How messy did it get publicly or privately? How messy did it get? They never got too messy. She kept doing her thing. He kept doing his thing. He and I here just uh uh. You girl, you girl, you girl, you girl, you go. No, he got into another long term relationship. You see what I'm saying? He was still out here working, still out here grinding, still out here being him. She was out here working. She was out here grinding. She was doing her. I'm just saying, for them to find love for each other, like after his breakup and all of that, and they started back performing together, and the chemistry still be there, and the love for each other, like the feelings starting to grow again. Y'all see each other in a different light than you did 10 years ago or whatever the case. 
That's a beautiful thing. That's just a timing thing. But some people don't just dissolve like that. They got to go out there. Oh, I, I, then. All right, then. I'm finna go fuck your brother. Or I'm finna go fuck your sister or your cousin. Or I'm finna go fuck you. They just go out here and just ruin it. So even if it was something that was just, okay, we just in two different places in life. We ain't on the same page. You know what I'm saying? Like. It's people, the maturity level. So don't just accept anything back. You see what I'm saying? Even if it is a love thing, how bad did they kick you? How much dirt did they throw? How bitter did they get? How much did they do a mine, mine, mine? What did they do? You see what I'm saying? I'm not, like I said, I'm not against reconciliations though. I'm really not. I love it. And I'm not just for them, but I look at something as a whole. That's just what I am. I can look at something from the full picture, the whole thing. I look at everything like, and it don't take all day to look at it. You just look at it and just see like, okay, that makes sense because you ain't tapped out of the real world. Like this, the real world. But I, I, I love that for them. And it's like, I feel like somebody just that close to her can look just I don't know what it is. It's just, it's something about it. It's something about it that just don't feel right. It just didn't feel right to me. And I'm like, I'm really genuinely happy for somebody I don't even know. I don't even know, know Ashanti or Nancy. And I don't know how their relationship gonna be five years from now. But the fact that this woman is pregnant, they already been married for six months, it's been confirmed, even the way they got engaged, the way she handled her business, the way she do stuff, I love her. I just love her as a person. I'm telling you, like, we could definitely, like, she is a friend that you would love to have. Because, hell, you want the friends who don't tell their own business like that. Them be the ones that could keep your secrets. For real. you As long as you know who you're dealing with, you're good to go. Like Tasha K said, that's why my friends don't tell me nothing. She said, hell, I can't help it. <laughs> like, you just got to know who you're dealing with. You got to know your who what's going on. And that could be something too. Maybe somebody telling y'all business. It's something like that. But I just feel like something ain't genuine love. It's just you related to them. And that ain't cool. And like I said, hey, it's so worth it. Thank you. But yeah, it's something that some, something could be seen about family, friends, somebody and somebody uh, about somebody round. I don't, people don't use round no more. But remember how people used to be like, that's my round. Yeah, it's somebody who will be in somebody click though. They in somebody circle or whatever. But there's somebody who close to you. They meant they supposed to be close to you, but they not really genuinely happy for you. So you need to be be aware of a snake. They don't love you like that, and they'll definitely cause you to bleed blood. For real, with the way this five of swords and this ace of cups out here, this bloodshed with the tower. Yeah, look, the world. Mm -mm. Something's ending for somebody. Now, this could just be the divine ending something for somebody because of something that somebody did to you. Because I feel like something does not affect you whatsoever. You are happy or you're about to be. Okay? Look, judgment, take the leap. And stop worrying about how people are going to feel about you. Because you you know how many things probably, you know, and, and it just kind of shows me. It's so much about that, though. And I could just be making false assumptions or something like that. But like I said, it's more of a feeling. These my personal thoughts and opinions. Everybody got one. It is what it is. But the way that person said that on that live and stuff. And the, me being genuinely happy for Ashanti and Nelly's joy. This woman, 43 years old. She's going to have her first child. And she waited. She wasn't necessarily waiting on him. And then the girl mentioned like something about... I don't want people to feel like they have to rush or in order to have an identity about themselves that uh, or the person gives them an identity about themselves or something. This lady 43 and we wouldn't even know you if it weren't for her. Like what are you talking about? We've always known. Boy, you give me so much joy. I used to wear my hair to the side and everything, my little ponytail to the side and everything, slit like that, just like fush. Honey, when I was in uh, middle school or something, baby, who? Child girl, we knew your sister. Well, we felt like it, baby, baby, baby. How many times I say that on here? I'll tell you, she just still, she still a little vibe. I'm telling you, boy, give me what she say. Bring me so much joy. Everything I need, bring me some honey. Let me touch, babe. I'm telling you, don't 
don't play. Don't play. Don't play, baby. We don't even know you. Respectfully. Okay? I mean, and all, all, you know, I get it. You protect the little baby sister and everything and all that. Let that lady be happy. That's it. That's all we want. Please. Please. Just let her be happy. Let her do her thing. She deserve that. You don't think so? It's something like that going on here. So y'all keep that in mind for y'all own personal stories. You deserve to be happy. This is happy, happy. So go be happy. That's what you need to do. That's all. It's, it's really that simple. Some people out here out here hurt and out here carrying other people's baggages and loads and burdens and all of that. Well, if I said it, I feel, I feel bad if I don't da 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 Baby, you carry your cross. What you doing? This like a type of energy too. Where say, you know, you taking care of your kids. This and the third. Somebody else ain't taking care of theirs. And you feel like, well, I feel bad. I feel bad because my nieces and nephews can't. And da, 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 da. But you don't really have the coins for that or something like that. To even if you got it like that, yes. But if they parent ain't doing nothing absolutely nothing and you your pocket really can't extend that far and it will hurt and cripple you in the end don't be trying to do all this extra you know what i'm saying it's something like that too but it'll make this is just me showing my support or to make the family happy but you can't afford it what are you doing this is offering when you in debt you can't offer when you in debt I'm not saying you, you can offer something else. What else can you do? You bake pies and cakes and somebody, if they bring you the food, you will cook it for them. That's a service. That's offering. But offering money and you ain't got none is crazy. That's insane. Let me get one on the tower. I don't know who message that's for too. Mm -hmm. I don't know. Let me get one on the tower. Middle of things. Beautiful wife. Look at that. Who that's by? Sango off the album North. I don't know. Let me get one on the tower. Maybe somebody from up north. Maybe somebody's headed north. Uh, you got the uh, Eight of Cups. Ooh, yeah. This is a shocking... Somebody's leaving here. Look, Four of Cups, Seven of Cups. It's, it's something about it that's kind of... It's... Now, somebody could be... No, this shocking. I feel like... I feel like somebody just leaves though and then they're like found yeah I feel like somebody leaves and they're just found whoever this is it's like a shocking exit here it's it's yeah but I feel also feel like there's some kind of funny business going on something could be like a uh, like the result of an investigation here yeah, something to deal with somebody who could be... I feel like somebody could have been hiding something. There's also somebody who enters this quite shocking. I feel like you're not expecting something. Or somebody isn't expecting something. Something just rolls up. Something just rolls up. It does. It rolls up. It either beats on the door. Or it busts in. Okay? Whatever this is. Let me get one on the, on the temperance. Yeah. So, I don't know what's up with that. Temperance... Temperance is clarified by the Strength card. Okay, and the Ten of Swords. Wow. Oh my goodness. Oh my. You got the Seven of Wands, the Justice card. Oh wee. So I feel like something something deals with force. Somebody has to be put down. Yeah, so that could be what something is. This could be people rolling up. The people rolling up and then they're like, like trying to get some order or something like that so if it's like a you know cops or something like that and they trying to get some order and then somebody like books and then they have to like put the energy down that's what i'm getting here with the seven of wands and the justice card and something just being sudden like this let me get one on the emperor yeah this will be somebody that the lot like they're like Come on, can you come with us? Or we want to talk to you, or we want to search this, or we want to do this or that. And somebody just kind of just like, nah. Let me get one on the emperor.
The Emperor is clarified by the Two of Wands. Now, this is the exact same position that the Emperor came out in the Sagittarius bonus yesterday. So, whoever this is could be a Sagittarius. This boss figure. Yeah, but we talked about this. We talked about something being someone being a Sagittarius in the Sagittarius bonus. I mean, in the Aries bonus. And then in the Sagittarius bonus, this Emperor was down here in the same corner with the two of wands clarifying it in the same corner. Temperance, Sag energy. Wow, high priestess, five of cups. Oh my God, this is big. Wow, to the 72 for you. So it's something going on with this boss figure. Something is really shocking about, or whoever this person is in uniform. However they leave is very shocking. Yeah, it is. But with this devil being right here. It looks like this could be how it collects. Yeah, let me get one on the devil. Yeah, I feel like something is too much. Something is too top heavy. It's at the max. Let me get one on the top. This. Let me get one on the devil. They want me to get another one on the tower. Let me get, uh, let me get one on this devil first though. Yeah, Ace of Cups. The Moon. Will of Fortune, Hangman, Three of Swords, Two of Swords, Three of Cups. Food card. Let me get one on the, on the tower. Yeah, they don't. Mm -mm. This is going to be, somebody don't know how something going to play out. They ain't going to never know. They will never know. They just know, they just going to know they're getting caught. Whatever this is, something's going to, it's going to hurt them. They just don't know what it is. It's a conflict that brings change. Three of Swords to the Two of Swords, Five of Swords. And it's their get back. That's all. Yeah, th this is, it, it's just Saturn collecting. I'm telling you. Let me get one on the tower. Ooh. And Saturn finished. So now the receding part in the last collective reading I just did makes sense. So Saturn is retrograded in Pisces. Y'all seen the Wheel of Fortune and the Hangman beside each other just being. Yeah, that's what this is. I'm telling you, what, something's gonna be something is significant about that. Mm hmm. Ooh, let me get one on the tower. Mm mm. So karma's coming back to get to bite somebody. It is somebody's karma coming back, and your karma is coming back. What's old to you is coming back. That part makes so much sense. Cause I'm telling you, it was like night and day. That reading was like, wow, it's literally only went one way. Let me get one on the tower here. Give me more on this. How's this tower happening? Give me give me something else on this tower. The Five of Cups and the King of Cups. Somebody mourns. Something is very emotional. This is a lot of cups. Something deals with a lot of water. For real. The Hangman. I don't know if somebody gets stuck or if somebody drowns. Oh, somebody could drown. Now, I don't know. This could be drowning in debt, but something is a lot of water. Okay? Somebody got Scorpio how they aspect it. I don't know. What's up with this? I feel like something is strong. Whatever this is or this crate is back. They say yes. <laughs> this, I feel like the, the presence or like the energy is going to be so wild it, or it is you know we are still in the full moon energy full moon in capricorn was yesterday okay uh the moon the will of fortune i'm so yeah the will of fortune with the hangman that's what this is mm. wow so somebody don't have long somebody could be on life support or they end up on life support i see you did come on didn't it it sure did when we were talking about his Shanti sister. Um, well, we weren't talking about her. We were just having a look, you know, fun for a moment. Okay. Kind of. Um, but yeah, so I feel like somebody could be planning this. I feel like somebody could be leaving on their own. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Now, this could be somebody like just turn, like somebody could just be turning themselves in. But I do feel like somebody's stuck in the head about something. They do not want to face something. Whoever this is, they plan to leave. 
because whatever this is that this new beginning is so 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 emotional something deals with a lot of water though the tower is clarified by the eight of cups the king of cups and the five of cups that's a lot of water with touching the eight of cup ace of cups with the devil down here clarified by the ace of cups now unless something is like a lot of blood or a lot of blood shed or a long something deals with that though i just feel like so this is a type of energy where somebody knows it's it's just a demon talking to them and, and it's the fact that they don't want to face their shadow somebody just doesn't want to face their shadow whatever this is whatever this next part of somebody's life is they're gonna have to face what they've done and they don't want to face that look the eight of pentacles they're going to do this shadow work they have the ten of wands and they don't want to something's too painful it's either too painful to witness it's too painful to sit through it's too painful they don't they don't want to do this somebody is not they don't they're not gonna this is an energy that has done the crime but does not plan to serve the time they do not want to do that look do not disturb is on by xavier omar off the app off the album the everlasting wave yeah somebody could be like really literally swept up in a wave Now, something could also deal with, like, this could be somebody's child. Now, whoever this child is, like, this boss figure, this could be, like, their grown child. Like, somebody could be grown. But you take it how it resonates. Let me get one on the Ace of Cups. Like, whoever this is, there'll be somebody that, like, they're not, like, a little child. They, like, they'll be, like, my age or older or somewhere around. They just grown. Okay? Let me get one on the Ace of Cups. Ace of Cups, please. Something, whatever this is, though, this exit is very emotional. It, oh, it's, it's just very. Look at it, the Ace of Wands. You got the King of Wands here, the Emperor, the Three of Pentacles. These two could work together. Yeah, something could be like a father and a son operation, or something deals with a father and a son being a, a father being a third party. So that could be what something is too. So it's something. Is a tower that happens here. Whatever this tower is, I don't know if somebody wants to retaliate. So somebody could be saying something or somebody gets clarity and they get some kind of truth. It's heartbreaking. It's too much. It could be in regards to their child. It is too much. It's too much. Somebody like, oh, no, that was the last strike. Oh, no. I'm telling you, somebody wants to grab them a Glock and go crazy. That's what this is. Off of whatever this is. Cause this is this is I'm telling you, like depending on how bad the situation is, somebody feels betrayed. Somebody feels like something is the ultimate betrayal. Okay? And if they daddy did this to them, or if this really the real story, or this really what it is, for some people, that's what it is. But they've been working with this energy okay or they work hard to be able to like i was just saying about the family something is a family thing okay it's literally family affair it's a family thing it's like oh my god like whoever this king of cups is is in their feelings because their dad betrayed them they are they in their feelings and and they may have even done something they either worked super hard or they took the route that they took to make their father proud or this and the third and it's like the father is a letdown like wow whoa i did i've been living my life aspiring to be just like you and you were the third party in my relationship wow it's something wild like that something also has something to do with somebody who's deceased they no longer here and somebody lying and about that child and somebody who can't speak for themselves is saying that child is mine. Somebody's dad is deceased. Yeah, it look like. I mean, mm -hmm. somebody's dad is deceased. Their real father is deceased. That's what it look like. Okay. Um, but yeah, it's but it's a family affair. Okay. But once again, we talk about this more on Patreon. You could, it, it. Let me get one on the Ace of Swords. 
it get a little it's too much to be out here like that uh but yeah it says let go and enjoy okay but something is it's like that though this could be a this could be two brothers one brother is older than the other brother one this is siblings this could be siblings this could be God, it's just a mess let me get one on the ace of swords but you're seeing the truth about something or somebody is seeing the truth about something and it hurts it's very hurtful you got the magician yeah they seeing the manipulation look queen of pentacles nine of cups six of swords i feel like somebody is greedy they do too much they want too much okay uh they're a very uh excessive person they like things in excess they go over the top whoever this is okay or somebody or de something deals with some kind of debt something has went over the top or over the limit something is over the limit Mhm. Mm something is definitely over the limit or somebody took it too far they took it past the point of where they they can't return whatever this is whoever this is they can't based off of who their side person is yes yeah, somebody could be finding out who somebody's side person really is okay page of swords page of cups mm -mm. page of wands oh my god somebody somebody could really somebody could have like a whole family like at a distance like yeah somebody could have like somebody could be hiding somebody could what is this oh my goodness yeah i feel like somebody has like a whole family at a distance or something deals with somebody whoever this person is something deals with the truth of who somebody's side person is now i don't know the side person could be somebody knows something that they haven't been sharing and that's what hurts the most something also deals with someone um something deals with outside children for for, for some okay there's something going on with that but somebody has like this would be like somebody who has like children like maybe they already have like an outside child or two or maybe, i don't know but this is like somebody has like a secret lover and that secret lover has like three of their kids like for real for real somebody's getting that type of truth yeah because it's definitely a third party situation here too somebody is pouring out love out of two cups right here with the ace of cups and the ace of cups twice it ain't love though clearly i mean but this is just a toxic individual they're greedy they just a liar they feel like they able to pull something off or something deals with three kids i don't know i feel like this is somebody i feel like there's somebody here who could start like they they have a practitioner they do work on people somebody could see that like they could see that and i feel like somebody something also deals with like like this would be kid like this would be kids with like one of them stands out it's like one of them stands out well two of them look more alike but one of them looks nothing like the other two like two of these kids on here have like kind of blondish reddish oranges hair this one right here has like a darker dark hair dark short hair so i don't know it's something about this energy right here somebody is seeing the truth about this energy right here okay but i do feel like some of you have a lot of eyes on you okay you could be attracting a lot of attention for some of you okay you could be highly celebrated but in and, and something has something to do with your manifestations but just be mindful i feel like you could see something you could see some kind of manipulation here okay and it could be in regards to like your wife for some of you wife husband whoever this wife is his wife this husband or somebody does somebody sees this or a wife sees this about their husband or a husband sees this about their wife it's just a lot of stuff going on out here okay it's a lot there's truth there's clarity something is a lot it's heartbreaking it's hurtful whatever this is like i said somebody out here is retaliating somebody out here is just leaving it's time of death out here it's just a lot okay it's a lot okay it's not really just like one thing it's just it's a lot okay can i is on somebody could definitely be speaking up to you somebody that you manifested okay i do see new love out here something could definitely be in the beginning stages okay 
But please, I feel like whatever something is, like I said, is happy, happy with you. But this is, this is like just what's going on, like just in the collective in general. Your stuff is happy, happy, but just like the, it says let go and enjoy. Just like the example I used with the Shanti. This is not making announcements. And that's what Spirit doing for y'all right here. They ain't really making announcements, but they really putting out here what's already going to be public anyway. This, this, this is by the public for the public. This is people who make per public service announcements anyway. Or these are people who always in your business. This day business. You see what I'm saying? It's something like that. You over here happy, happy, finna experience love unbound, receiving support that you need, changes that you've been man want to manifest for yourself, resting, just doing your thing, doing your norm, whatever your norm would be, doing what you feel like doing. You got the energy to do it. Why not? Look at this addiction. So it says an addiction is affecting this relationship. This could be an addiction of any kind. Okay. Drugs, sex, alcohol anything okay something is going on rejection vulnerability marriage yeah i feel like somebody is obsessed with a person yeah somebody is obsessed with a person and so they block them from having love they obsessed with and this could be some it's just weird it's weird it's like a weird are they just obsessed of, with what you could do for them how you could give to them maybe you're their company maybe you're their support maybe this maybe that you know maybe it gives you something to do they saying find something else to do it says be open to love yeah there's definitely an emotional beginning here okay but let me get one of these to lead to 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 close it with okay addiction rejection yeah say no say no maybe you maybe somebody could be offering you something to drink here is what it looks like be mindful of that it's something in that cup it's something in that cup or something in that blunt but we've been picking it up for a minute it's something in it or if something was in it somebody is getting that type of clarity out here too now somebody drugged their loved one or they poisoned their loved one. They did put something in somebody's food or drinks or whatever their way to relax would be. Mm -hmm. They did. That's what this is now. And and that's why I said there's something in that cup. That's clarifying the devil. It's something in that cup. It's something in that cup. It's something somewhere. Okay. And that could be what's being seen too. And whatever it is, it's hurtful. It is hurtful. Okay, let me see. Give me something. I feel like somebody know, like they, like I said, somebody feels like they have nowhere else to go because to face this, just to say it, they come face to face. Like, did you do this to this person? Like, somebody don't want to even be questioned. They don't even want to be interrogated about this. They don't want to be questioned about this. Nothing. That's why they want to leave. Yeah, clearing. Yeah. Mm -mm freedom uh clearing says as true offering arises it becomes easy to let go you start to trust that more will always arrive you shift from my my mind to god's 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 such freedom okay freedom says i no longer want this fiery ring of resentment to block the good release me from his bonds okay so, so some of you are just re uh freeing yourself or somebody wants to free themselves look grief or they want you to stop holding on to this you worry more about other people feeling this say feelings this says grief this says trust this is faith okay so something is happening for you something is happening to free you like you may even grieve whoever this is that's leaving or passing away you may actually grieve them but something is definitely happening for you it's happening for you so that you ain't going through no towel moment later when you really 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 in the deep and in the thick of your happiness you got somebody coming up talking about hell the f no and all of that you don't want that okay <laughs> But anyway, I'm going to leave it there. Majors in this reading is uh, Scorpio, Sagittarius, Aries, Capricorn, okay? Uh, and Gemini. Uh, you Or Leo. Leo. That could be the energies of your family members, you, them, kids, dads, mothers, whoever, okay? Just this community of friends, whoever. But I'm going to leave it there. Please be sure to like, share, comment, and subscribe. Bye. Look, brand new is on by Lacan. 
by a uh, Lakin. I still can't pronounce that. Uh, off the album, so you know, everything gonna be brand new. Just so you know. <laughs> Bye, y'all.